Hello everyone, I'm the Ushu World Champion Sunny Lai. Today I'm going to teach you a stretching routine that will help you improve your kicks. Let's go! The flexibility of all parts of your body are important for Ushu. Today, we will only focus on improving the flexibility of your hamstring and hip flexor. These are the important for your kicks. The strain routine is perfect for beginners who are trying to increase their flexibility. Okay, first, before you stretch, you must always warm up your body. Warm up for 5 to 10 minutes, even more, until your heart rate increases and you start to sweat. Your increased body temperature will help you strain further and prevent injury. You can pause this video until you are warmed up and then continue with me. Exercise 1. Press your foot up on wider than shoulders. Open your arm in a straight line. Now, you can touch the floor. Use your left hand to touch the right side. Also, like, use your right arm. Hold your left foot and for 10 seconds and then you can stretch. Also, you have to feel really, really stretch your hemisphere and switch sides and hold it another leg for 10 seconds. Very good, hold on. Good job, next. Exercise two, press your foot together like straight and try hard to use your finger touch the floor and 10 times. Mess your finger together and bend all the way down as low as you can do. The goal is to be able to touch the floor with the entire palm of your hand. Don't worry, if you can't do it yet, now lunge gently up and down 10 times. And then you can fix them and you can improve. Now grab the back of your legs and pull yourself down just a little bit more and hold this for 10 seconds. Jayo, you can do it! Open your legs and choose the bone stance in high position and just like up down, up down, move your body and you can stretch. And you have to feel a little bit stretch your arms free and also the both legs have to be use a little bit power. Now we put a left leg behind you and choose this position, just go up, down, up, down for 10 times and then we can switch. Also, have to be care your back leg have to be straight. Very good. Okay, Dio. Here we go. Press your right foot forward and hook your foot up. This is very important and we engage your hamstring more. And now you can switch another leg. In the meanwhile, you have to be careful about your left leg be straight. Okay, now grab your foot with your both hand and then hold this position for 10 seconds or even more. And then you can switch other leg. Also, you have to be hold this position for 10 seconds or even more. Jayo, good job. Okay, next. Open your legs and make your right knee touch the floor and your up down, up down. Yes, very good. So each leg you can do 10 times or even more, 20 or 30. Yeah, it depends on you. Very good. And good job. Okay, now we are trying another movement for stretch. And use your 
right arm touch the floor and hold for five seconds and then open your arm look at the scar or look at your arm and then back to hook your right leg and be straight very good at each side you have to do 10 times and then switch the bows use your left arm touch the floor and hold this position for five seconds and open your arm look at the sky and then back hook your foot making your leg straight very good Ciao. We are doing drop stands, toe up each side 10 seconds and say down more and up down and up down. Also, like you can feel a little bit stretch in the lower body like your back leg and use your arm touch your toe and hold this position for 10 seconds and then you can switch other side and it depends on you and if you think which side it's worse and you can do more yes good hold in 10 seconds or 20 seconds very good keep going Jayo. yes and you can make your leg touch the floor try as possible you can do that but if you can't do that that's fine we can still practice and makes perfect very good Jayo. this is very very important for wushu cakes and it helps a lot first you can choose a lower position for beginner and hold your foot and make your toes go up and then you can try as possible you can do and use your arm and hold the forehead for 10 seconds and then you can try hard part your put reach your nose yes very good also your mouse one and two very good now put your leg in high position and try hard to move your body up down up down and then make sure the both leg happy to straight and also hook your foot excellent and use your both arm to hold your foot yes good try your best to make your toe reach your forehead yes don't hurt yourself okay reach your nose and then you can try reach your mouth good job stretch rotate hip and leg out hips facing out now stretching to your side self stretching use your hand to touch your foot also you can hold your stretch in for 10 seconds or even more yes very good also you can choose the high position it depends on you it will feel very easy for you and you can put high as possible you can put in high position yes make sure your belt leg has been too straight excellent hold on Jayo. Once you are comfortable with the routine, you should increase the time of each stretch to 20, 30, 40 seconds. 
the longer and harder you stretch, the faster you will see improvement. And you must stretch consistently. Getting flexible is hard work. Thanks for joining me. See you next time. Bye bye.